Rescue me, rescue me, rescue me. We are back down here at the San Luis Obispo Animal Services Division with a house full of dogs and cats who are dying. No, I don't want to use that word, but they want to get out of here. Yes, they do. Welcome back, Deborah. Thank you. And before we talk about Pogo, who is a doll here, people just keep getting a good look at him. I want to say a few things about the 4th of July, which is upon us. You know, your dogs hear that fireworks and out they go they run they don't want to but they run so please 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 keep your dogs w with you make sure they have id on sharpie marker on the collar works tags work so that they can be returned to you quickly because what happens to us here is the dogs come in and then they have to wait out that whole holiday weekend for you to come in and redeem them and that's really no good so get the ids on the collars and keep your dogs close to you Absolutely. We want to get them home. Um, hopefully, well, we want them not to come here in the first place. But in if the they are going to come here, we want to get them home. They're precious. They should be at home. So seriously, we're always saying IDs on collars. But for this particular weekend coming up, 4th of July weekend, make sure of it. And number two, July 6th, Deborah, we've got a fun event happening at Laguna Lake Park. We're doing... Um, Goldens in the Park. 250 golden retrievers at one time together in the park. And everybody's welcome, whether you have a golden retriever or not. Any kind of dog that you've got at home is welcome at this event. And it's a kind of a little fundraiser for Woods and ASAP, which is us. So we really would like you to come down. We'll have a booth there. You can meet us. You can see what we've got for sale. Naturally, we'll have ID tags, which is not so boring. And uh, you can have a good time. So two things, 4th of July, ID tags, make sure of it. And July 6th, let's see if we'll see you at Laguna Lake Park from 12 until 4, I think it goes on. Yeah, games, prizes, surprises, just come. I'm very relieved you don't get drummed out if you bring a non-golden to this No, affair. no, no, no. Okay. We like all, yeah, 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 all dogs. And stop by the booth. I'd like to see your dogs if you have one. Now, on to Pogo, Deborah. We have an unusual number of small dogs. We have over 20 small dogs down here wow. right now. And we also have a fair amount of seniors. And darling little Pogo is one of them. About eight or nine years old, this little precious dog's owner could not keep him anymore. He is the sweetest thing. All he wants to do is sit on your lap. He gets along very well with other dogs. He'll hang out with them too, but mostly he's a people dog. And he is a fabulous little guy. And because of his eight or nine years, he is oh, eligible yes. for a senior rebate, which means... That is great. All of the seniors here, Pogo being one of them, $35 rebate if you adopt a senior. So... It's a no-brainer, really. Absolutely. And they're and so wonderful. They've well, already learned how to be a good dog. They're easy. Older dogs are so easy. His ID number is 942-627. This is Pogo. This is Duke. Look at that sweet face. You know, I Duke, love the head tilt. He, oh, he has half of his adoption fee paid. That's what it is. He's only That's six. A uh, Duke is best with female dogs. He would also love to be an only dog. He just loves his people. So ID number 179871, longest residing, wanting to get out of here, Duke. This is Brandy. She's another one of our longer residing dogs. She is very calm, although the, the monitor's freaking her out a little bit. Um, house trained, very good on the walk, and she loves the Frisbee. She is our volunteer's pick of the month as Yay, well. Yay, Brandy. Which means 5250 gets taken off of her adoption fee, so she's a bargain and she's gorgeous. ID number 198354, Brandy. Jax is a little out of sorts today. He just had his neuter surgery. He's a... a year old owner turn in um Jax is a really sweet loving dog he's gorgeous too uh he's good with he's pretty good with female dogs he does not like male dogs so this is someone who needs to be in a female dog home or an only dog but he is so gorgeous he'll get you noticed Jax's id number is 199768 she might win the prize as the sweetest dog in the shelter dolly is wonderful her people could no longer keep her at 10 years old, she got stuck in a shelter. She is a doll. She's good with all dogs, but she is particularly fond of little ones, and she likes cats. So we put her out in the mosh pit of little dogs and just let her hang with the little guys all the time. She's that I'd wonderful. like to see. It's great. She has the senior rebate of $35, and she is worth every single penny and every emotion you'll ever put into her. She's fabulous. 940-852, our wonderful, precious Dolly. Well, Crash is our resident. Interesting case. When he first came in, he'd been hit by a car, and he'd scream every time he got near his head, but he's doing a lot better there. Um, he, 
actually does well with big female dogs. We put him out with the female pit bulls and these great little dogs he doesn't like so much. Uh, but he is really, really sweet uh, with people, really great. And he's just really interesting, this little guy. 199176 is Crash's ID number, and he is so ready to get out of here. This is sweet, gentle Samson. This is just a really nice dog. He's about seven years old, eligible for the senior rebate. His ID number is 199732. This is Sparky, and his uh, foster mom, Sandy, would like you to know she needs you to get a, adopt him quickly because she's getting way too attached because he's almost a perfect dog. He crates well. He's housebroken. He does great with all of her other dogs. He does good down at the beach playing with other dogs. Gets along with everybody. She thinks maybe younger kids might make him a little bit nervous, but older children would be fine. She just has nothing but great things to say about this little guy, and she's going to have a hard time giving him up, but she will because she's a great foster. His ID number is 197452, and if you want to talk to Sandy about Sparky, please call the shelter, and they will get in touch with Sandy and have her get in touch with you. This is Sparky. Wally is a shelter favorite. He's about eight years old, flat-coated retriever mix, a wonderful dog, very, very active outside. Um, but then when you get him inside and in the car, inside a building, he is super calm and loving and just wants to lay around with you. Terrific dog. He has half of his adoption fee paid. Um, he does not do well with cats, so that's something, you know, but he's good with other dogs and just an all-around fabulous guy. Wally's ID number is 199023, and we just cannot wait to see this guy in his new home. He is so sweet. I have been down here long enough to know we have a lot of mini pin lovers in this area and we have a mini pin mix here named Cookie. Three years old, spayed female, a little sweetheart. And great ears. She does have good ears. ID number 199544. This Wait a minute. is Cookie. Her half adoption fee is You're paid. Right. Half price dog, everybody. Half price dog. Blue light special. Here she is. Cookie, ready to go home with you. This is Eli. He is a fairly mellow, easygoing dog. Uh, he is a just beautiful dog. He's sort of peaty esque He looks like a little rascal's dog. Really good with female dogs, like some males, doesn't like some other males. So probably better to go with a female or an only dog home. Um, he's very loving, very sweet, and he's so pretty. His ID number is 199096. This is Eli. This dog has the most gorgeous sleek coat you've ever seen. It is shiny black. It looks like glass, and he's got great ears. There's, you can't beat a dog with his ears piled on top of his head. You just can't. It's a talent. This is Macho. Uh, his owner could no longer keep him. He's been very good down here with other dogs. He's, uh, his owner said good with kids. Um, a really nice young dog, just about a year old. And he's a nice number, size. He's a great size. Great he's kind of medium. Mm -hmm. 199399, gorgeous Macho. How about the look of this dog, Deborah? She is a fascinating looking dog. You don't see these dogs very often, Terry. Um, um, Fox Terriers aren't that, you know, pop. No, no. Well, I don't want to say popular, but they're, they're not, there's not that many of them. She is a little Fox Terrier. And she's and full grown. This is it. Yes, this is it. Nice, smallish to medium sized dog. Just beautiful. Her name is Macy. She's about four years old. And her ID number, 199259. Chippy kind of breaks my heart. He's just a year and a half old, and his owners had a housing problem, and they could no longer keep him. And they have nothing but fabulous things to say about this dog, that he gets along with cats, dogs, children, house trained, um, has some basic obedience training, crate trained, likes to play frisbee, go on walks. This is just wow. a little sweetheart. Ideal. And he's under two years old. And he's under two years old. He's a wonderful little dog. Sometimes the plain little brown dogs have a hard time getting out of here. It drives me crazy. I have one at home. They're great. Chippy's ID number is 199367. He's a doll. Great ears, Deborah. Isn't she the cutest little thing? She really is. Just a year old. Um, her name, well, it's LAPD. We call her Lappy. I don't, I don't know how you're supposed to pronounce it, but she's such a sweetheart. Um, change in housing. Owner couldn't keep her. Just a little sweet doll. ID number 199368. Oh, I don't know why, Deborah, but Benjamin looks a bit puzzled. He does. He has sort of a sweet, pathetic look on his face, but he sure is cute. He's only about four years old. He was tied to a post in San Luis Obispo, so he ended Come up here. on. Yeah, I don't know how to get that kind of stuff. Benjamin, he's just a nice four-year-old dog who needs a nice home to go to. I'm sure he would love everybody and everything in that We home. need a happy ending to that we story. We do. You don't tie your dog to a post and leave it there. <sighs> ID number 199651. This is Benjamin. Benjamin, look at us, buddy. Look at us. 
Adorable. Oh, there's the ears. This is a newcomer to the shelter. Came in on the 23rd of June. Uh, has a license and his name is apparently Yo. He is seven years old. Picked up in um, Arroyo Grande, Hausna Road. So somebody is missing their little Shih Tzu. He's an awful nice little guy. Very sweet. ID number 199871. If his owners don't come get him, he is going to get adopted fast because he's cute. Oh, poor little Cricket is the sweetest thing. She is not enjoying being on camera. She's not liking this at all, but she is a sweet, lap-sitting, kiss-giving, just little doll, very house-trained, loves her ball toys. Cricket's four years old with an ID number of 199556. This is Zeke. He is so darn good looking. Zeke um, is a great dog, about two years old, affectionate and loving. Again, kind of prefers female dogs to male dogs, and he likes regular girls too. Dale's getting kisses and all kinds of affection over there. Zeke's ID number is 199097. Got a nice salami head. This boy needs to go home with you. I think he knows how cute he is. He totally knows. This little sweetie family could no longer keep her. Um, She's only five years old. She is way too heavy, folks. This wow. girl needs a weight reduction and a lot of love. Um, she's better with older children. She's fabulous with adults, and she's good with other dogs. She's just a lovely little Cocker Spaniel. Sadie's ID number is 165173. Oh, this little dog is so cute. This is Winston. He's just four years old. He was a stray picked up in Paso on the 7th of June. So somebody should be missing this sweet little guy, but he's up for adoption now and he is a doll. ID number 199595. He might be the winning ear dog. I don't know. He's got a lot of competition though. We got some fine ears in this place this week. Oh, little Roxy was confiscated because apparently there was an eviction situation. She's a nice little dog. She's only two. She's great on your lap and she loves to be held. Her ID number is 198424. One of our many, many, many little dogs down here right now. ID number 198474. Did I say that? 12 years old, sweet as pie, lost her home. Very sad. She's breaking our hearts down here. This is Brandy. Uh, obviously, she gets the senior rebate, so that's some money back for you if you take an older dog into your home and into your life for their retirement. She's a fabulous, or he, uh, yes, yeah, she is a fabulous, fabulous girl. Her ID number is 038396. 038396, adorable Brandy who needs her retirement home. This lovely little girl was abandoned and she was brought to the shelter and she was lucky enough to get fostered by Sandy who loves her very much. Um, she is an older girl. She uh, does have half of her adoption fee paid. She's sweet, crate trained, affectionate, gets along well with other dogs, although uh, Sandy does think she'd probably be most comfortable in a home with an older person or older couple a little bit. So kind of a, a calm, quiet existence. Uh, Stormy's ID number is 167754. And if you're interested in this darling little girl, call the shelter and they will get in touch with Sandy, who will get in touch with you. She this little cutie pie was picked up as a stray in Atascadero at Morrow Road in Kerberil. Um, just on the 10th of this month, uh, just a darling little dog, the 10th of June, I should say. He's uh, got neutered, so he's licking his stitches, so he's, he's got the cone of shame on for a few days. But this is a great little dog, very sweet, good on the leash, plays with the other dogs in the yard, great little dog. ID number 199450, this is Journey. This is a relative newcomer to the shelter, arrived on the 20th of June from Arroyo Grande at the Branch Elementary School and uh, the School Road and Branch Mill. Anyway, this is a great looking dog, a hound dog. We think he's about three years old. We hope his owner is going to come look for him. ID number 199831. If he does not have an owner coming to get him, we're going to name him Leon Redbone. That is a great looking dog. Sassy. Wait a minute, Deborah. Before you talk about Sassy, okay. I want Greer to show that good canvas collar. It's a light color, and it could have, in no uncertain terms, Sharpie marker with a phone number on it. Do you see any reason why that can't happen right there where he's pointing? So this is what we're talking about, folks. Fourth of July coming up, fireworks, get the phone number on the collar. Back to Sassy. Please do that. This is a lovely dog. Um, she is about 11 years old. Very sweet. Does not really act like an 11-year-old. She's uh, slowing down, but she still has lots of life and lots of energy in her. Uh, she has a senior rebate of $35, so that helps with the adoption fee. 
And her ID number is 185600. All right. Appealing to the big-hearted people out there in San Luis Obispo County or anywhere else for that matter, we have a little blind girl here. She's 11 years old. She's lost her home. Um, she's a very good dog. She will follow around other dogs. She takes the lead from them. She has a senior rebate, so you get some money back. She's a good little girl. She's sweet. 187520. This is Gigi. 18 months old. This little guy will get you noticed. You're going to get Terry a lot said. of questions. People He's are going to say, what kind of dog is him? That's really interesting. Mm -hmm. um, fascinating looking dog. Uh, so anyway, needs a new home. ID number 199793. This dog is splendid. Little wire hair, doxy, Norfolk Terrier kind of deal going on there. Oh, and he's the so ear cute. situation, one up, one down. Oh, look at that. That's the cutest thing ever. Uh, he was found on the 10th, or no, the 19th of June. Um, Cayucas in Cayucas. Someone's got to be looking for this little doll baby. His ID number is 199807. If someone doesn't, we're not supposed to do this, but if someone doesn't come get him, he's going to get named Kevin. He looks like a Kevin to me. Look at that ear. That is spectacular. Kev. Oh, he likes it. Okay, Terry, we've seen some ears today, but yeah. look at that. I oh, my goodness. I think these are the number one. Wow. Six months old. Been here since the 14th of June. I cannot believe this dog is still here. That's the cutest thing ever. I well, think almost. he's overlooked. He's got to be six months old. Don't know what he is, but he's red and he's cute and he's got that ear. Wow. We're calling him Squiggles. ID number 199720. Man alive. That is cute. Wow. Well, now there's a little cutie pie. This is Heidi. She's about three years old. Little Karen Terrier mix. Um, does great with other little dogs. Has a, basically a just a great personality. She will chase a cat. So if you have cats, you know, they can probably beat her up, but she might chase them. Her ID number is 199512. This is cute as pie, Heidi. This guy, relative newcomer to the shelter, uh, arrived on the 20th of June from Grover Beach. Um, nice little dog. He's pretty high energy. He's a lap sitter, though, when he calms down. He's got a pretty little face. He's about two years old, so apparently this is as big as this guy's going to get. Really adorable little dog. And he sits for treats. Soft, soft, soft to pet. Is he? Oh, he looks mm. soft. ID number 199832. What a cutie pie. Well, someone left a trio of little dogs in our night kennels on the 18th of this of June, and this is one of them. A really nice little guy. We think about eight years old, so qualifies for the um, senior rebate. He's got quite the underbite there, too. Very cute. And quite a wagging tail. He's a happy little guy. Mm. ID number 199785. We're going to call him Garth. This is another one of those little dogs left in our night kennels on the 18th of June. She's very sweet. She's very active at eight years old, so she's also eligible for the senior rebate. Um, we're going to call her Ivy. Her ID number is 199786. Come on, San Luis Obispo, come get all these little guys. And number three left in the night kennels on the 18th of June. A very sweet, dear little girl. Um, she's about seven years old, and, you know, she's just a darling, sweet little Pomeranian mix. ID number 199784. We're going to call her Trisket because she just looks so small and yummy and crisp. <laughs> this is a huge, huge dog. Look at the size of that thing. That would scare anybody. This is Chavo. He's a little sweetie who was found um, where in the South County area, uh, Beach Street and Oceano. What a doll. Just about eight years old, so he also is eligible for the senior remate. Just as tiny as he can be. ID number 199830, a little doll baby. Another enormous dog. This one found on Paloma Street in Atascadero on the 21st of June, wearing a beautiful little diamond studded collar there. You know what would make it even more beautiful is if it had a tag hanging from it that said who he was and where he belongs, and we could have taken him home. But that's okay. We have him, and he's waiting for his owner to find him or for someone to adopt him. ID number 199853. Hey, look, a small dog. We have a few of those this week. He's pretty cute. Uh, his name is TJ, four years old, neutered male, ready to get into a new home because his owners couldn't keep him anymore. ID number 920307. This is TJ. This is little Rosie. Um, she could not be kept any longer by her owners. Very nice little dog. Very cute. ID number 199874. And this is Cece. Her owners couldn't keep her anymore. She's three years old. Dachshund and Chihuahua, for those of us in the know, that is a Chihuini. And she is very cute. 
ID number 199873. This guy was found on the 18th um, in San Miguel of June, and, you know, nobody's come looking for him. He looks a little banged up, like maybe he got hit by a car or something. Bless his heart, but he's doing okay. He is a water dog extraordinaire. This guy loves to get in our little swimming pool uh, and just splash around and be a complete and total goofball. Uh, by the way, a dog that white and that pink, don't leave him out in the sun because that could also be some sun damage we're seeing on him. ID number 199702. We're going to call him Scotty. So here we are to show you all of our cats. And we're starting out with Lucy, who is a doll. Look at her, how beautiful she is. She is a calico, long-haired calico. She's just about nine years old. And she is declawed. If you are looking for a cat who's declawed, Lucy could be the one for you. You can save your money on that surgery and have a wonderful cat like Lucy. She is ID number 199249, and she deserves a great, great home. She loves to be on the lap. She will love you forever if you take her out of here. And that's Lucy's story, 199249. Next up, we have Sabina Beebe, and Sabina Beebe is 14 years old. She's a senior. What does that mean to you? We have a senior rebate in operation here. That's right. If you take any one of our seniors out and a senior is eight years or older, we give you a $35 rebate back on your adoption fee. So that works out great for you and the cats that are older because we get them out of here faster. Sabina's ID number is 199774. Best pet store in the county. Here is a Persian. We have a lot of people looking for these exotics. Well, here's one. It's a pure white Persian. This is Sugar Bear, and Sugar Bear is also a senior. That means Sugar Bear, he qualifies for the senior rebate. $35 back to put in your pocket if you adopt him. ID number 199697, Sugar Bear. Here's a very curious cat. Guess what his name is? You're right, it's Curious. Curious is a boy. He's just about six years old. As you can see, he's a black and white tuxedo. He has gorgeous topaz eyes. And his ID number is 199688. That's curious. Hello, Nelson. This is Nelson. He is four years old, and he is a black cat, as you can see. Great green eyes. Nelson qualifies for the black cat rebate. That's right. Any black cat that you adopt from us, you get $25 back on your adoption fee. Nelson is ID number 199715. Say hi to Moon Moon. Moon Moon is just three years old, and his ID number is 199540, and Moon Moon just happens to be our volunteer pick of the month of June. What does that mean to you? Well, that has half adoption fee paid. So if you adopt Moon Moon, you only pay half of his adoption fee. The ID number is 199540, Moon Moon. Here we have a beautiful, handsome boy. He's a long-haired black cat. But you're right, he does qualify for the black cat rebate, $25 back on Little Paw. Little Paw is a boy, he is two years old, and his ID number is 198664. Consider Little Paw. Well, I think Saji is stunning. He, I think, is a Maine Coon type. Don't you agree with me? He is just about two years old, absolutely gorgeous, and his ID number is 189309. So if you like the Maine Coons like I do, you were to love Saji. 189309. Here's a beautifully marked cat. This is Naomi. And look at her spots. She's got some tabby going on there. She's got white going on there. She has a really nice markings on her head. I think we're going to call her a Torby or a Tabby Calico of that nature. She is a senior, 11 years old, that qualifies her for the senior rebate. That's it, $35 back if you adopt Naomi. Her ID number is 199255, Naomi. Well, you gray cat lovers and Russian blue lovers who love grays and Russian blues, here is Mia, yes. Mia is just about two years old and I named Mia after my niece back in New Jersey because she loves cats too. Her ID number is 199762, and she's kind of a longish haired, really pretty girl. Nice green eyes. ID number 199762. That's Mia. Say hi to Whitey. He looks a little bit rough, but he'll clean up nicely. He's had a rough time out there wherever we picked him up in the woods. So look at his gorgeous blue eyes and imagine what he can look like, how handsome. He is a flame point Siamese. 
He's just about four years old, and his ID number is 199777. We're calling him Whitey. Say hi to Mason. Yes, you know, Mason is Mia's brother back in New Jersey, my nephew back there. So I think it's suiting that these two great cats be called Mia and Mason. Mason is just about four years old. He is obviously a very friendly cat. He has a little splash of white on his chest, and his ID number is 199780. That's Mason. Here's a pretty little black cat. This is Isabel. And Isabel's ID number is 199818. Yes, you are absolutely right. Isabel qualifies for the black cat rebate. $25 back in your pocket if you fall in love with her. Isabel, ID number 199818. For you guys who love black and white tuxedos, here's Caroline. She is just about three years old, and her ID number is 199828. And Caroline came here to us very, very frightened. She would be hiding behind a shield that was up on her cage. But now she's decided to come out a little bit. And this is the benefit of the volunteers here who take these cats and socialize them, get them out of their cages. They pet them, groom them, whatever, talk to them even, and bring them around. Because this is a pretty scary place for an animal to be. And these cages are so small that it's very hard for a cat to retain their catness in these cages. So consider volunteering. If you don't want to come down and take Caroline out of here, then consider volunteering and take many, many cats out of their cages and socialize them to make them more adoptable. Think about volunteering. ID number 199828, Caroline. Contrasting all the black cats we have here, here's a pure white one. This is Popcorn, a neutered boy, five years old, and his ID number is 199809, Popcorn. And here we have an all-black cat. He's a little bit scared, but he's coming around. He's really, really very nice. He's just about two years old, and we're going to name him Gabe. Yep, Gabe is my nephew back in New Jersey, and so now all three kids back in New Jersey, you have cats to think about that they get adopted, and hoping that the people come down here, take a look at these cats, and take them out of here. Little Gabe's ID number is 199869, and he qualifies for that black cat rebate. How much? $25 back in your pocket if you adopt Gabe. 199869. I know what you're thinking. We've seen very few tabbies today. Usually we have a lot of tabbies, very few. Cleo seems to be, I think, our first tabby. Cleo is female, just about three years old. She's gorgeous, don't you think? Look at that very white under and then the tabby markings on top. She looks so regal. We call her Cleopatra or Cleo for short. Her ID number is 199857. Cleo. Next up, we've got a black and white cat, Tuxedo Plus. Look, he's got a mustache. So we're calling him Mustachio. He is male. He's just about eight years old. So he qualifies for the senior rebate. That's right, $35 back in your pocket if you adopt Mustachio. His ID number, 199814. Here's a cutie pie. This is Cricket, and she is just 11 months old, and she is beautifully marked. She has a lot of tabby markings, a little Abyssinian look to her back, and it's all put together on white. And I love that little white over her nose and coming out under each eye. It really is distinctive. This cat's going to get you noticed if you take her out on a walk. She is ID number 199796, and her name is Cricket. Say hi to Petal. She is female. She's just about a year and a month old. Petal was very, very fearful when she first came here. She gave you one little hiss, but that's nothing. She is really calmed down and really accepting of people and petting and socialization and everything. Her ID number is 199264, and really give volunteering a thought. We have so many animals down here who could really use just human touch. That's all. It's going to really help them, and I guarantee it's going to help you too. 